is going on you guys Lou back at it again with another video now for today's video we're going to be talking about Anthony Davis because there is some crazy things going on right now in the NBA with Anthony Davis so first I want to talk about this Anthony Davis and his team have kind of made it known to the you know people of the Pelicans that hey these are the teams that if you trade me to these teams I'm willing to make a contract extension with these teams now those teams are the Lakers the Clippers, the Bucks, and one more team. I honestly forgot. I'm not going to lie. Now, that's interesting because it gives us insight that Anthony Davis is not only just looking at the Lakers. He's looking at other opportunities to be the number one and also have another guy that is a number one. So you can have two number ones on one team and be able to compete for a championship and also win. Okay. And I'm not mad at that. Honestly, I want to see it. I, I want to see him go to a team besides the Lakers. I ain't gonna lie. I just do not want him to win on the Lakers. The Bucks to me sounds way cooler. I ain't gonna lie. So that's interesting, okay? Now, with that being said, the Lakers supposedly, okay, or at least reportedly, offered one of the biggest offers that they've offered so far, okay? And that offer is Lonzo, Kuzma, Ingram, Rondo, Lance, Beasley, and two first round picks. And they're also willing to help with some cap relief on the Pelicans and take Solomon Hill. So Lakers are trying, okay? They're really, really trying right now because they have noticed that, hey, if we take our foots off the gas and not go for the guy that we want, we may not get a chance. They saw the Paul George situation. They see that Kawhi may be liking Toronto, you know? These are guys that they could have traded for and they didn't. So now they're in a position where they really, really got to make sure that they get Anthony Davis because if Anthony Davis goes to a different team that's not the Lakers, then LeBron and Magic Johnson they're in some trouble okay and that's going to be a situation i think by any means i think lebron gets a ring on the lakers just because of the fact that i think he's always going to land at least one free agent so he's going to get somebody but it may not be anthony davis and that's kind of good news i ain't gonna lie because i just want to see anthony davis go to like a team like the bucks or something in the east and make the east more powerful than rather making all the favorites in the league be on the west i kind of like having an even-sided you know affair with east versus west and I'm, I'm excited, okay? I'm very excited for this because this could be a big move for the Pelicans. If they can land Alonzo, Kuzma, Ingram, Rondo, Lance, Beasley, that's not bad, but you have to look at all the options. But my biggest problem is I'm not sure who has the value, okay? Because if you could get an offer like this, you know, who's really going to beat that necessarily, all right? I'm not sure. I'm not sure who could beat that offer unless they're just really risking too much, too much, you know? I don't know. So tell me what you guys think down below in the comments and like and subscribe for more. I'm out.